O God of the seventh day, God of the spirits of all flesh, you created all things and rested on the seventh day. The king of Egypt would not let our people go, no, not by a mighty hand, but you rescued them and took them to a fruitful land. In remembrance, seven days shall we eat unleavened bread, in the seventh day there shall be an holy convocation to us, no manner of warfare work shall be done. God makes the hungry to dwell, that they may prepare a city for habitation. The Lord God of our fathers, the God of Abraham, of Isaac, and of Jacob, appeared unto Native America, saying, I have surely visited you, and seen that which is done to you in Egypt. The God of the seventh day will restore sovereignty to the tribes of Native America, and will restore their lands. The righteous will be in gardens with springs, no fatigue will ever touch them therein, nor will they be asked to leave it. You brought our armies out of the land of Egypt, therefore shall we observe this day in our generations is by an ordinance forever. Amen. This is April Shaltais, using the computer to generate this message. My brother, Rendell Barry Shaltais, is dead. My brother, Todd Parrish Shaltais, is dead. My niece, Celeste Shaltais Conway, is dead. All dead, immoral people, today, are still using genocide for gain and amusement. They want me dead, too. This is Rome, and they decided to put me down. They don't need a reason, but I am an unmarried virgin past 50. I survived. So they are calling me a botched kill and they want to clean up the mess and finish the job. They don't want me to have any more birthdays. They poisoned my dogs. They used COVID as an excuse to take away my job, my health insurance, my phone, my internet. They blocked my 403b money and my retirement. They cut my power. They denied my unemployment. They also attacked my vehicles, disabling them and trying to tow them, again and again. This is April shall ties, and I want to live, not die for any reason, for with long life the Lord will satisfy me. This is Rome, and Rome wants you to die in the arena. Rome is still here. Rome crucified Christ and created Christianity to cover up the genocide of Jews, Africans, Muslims, Russians, Irish, Celts, Japanese, Chinese, Aborigines, Vietnamese, Koreans, Hmong, Hawaiians, Eskimos, Native Americans, and more. Mexicans are dying on the border every day. Never, never forget, never. The scriptures say, Lord of the worlds, you are our true master. Unquestionably, yours is the judgment, and you are the swiftest of reckoners. Children of Israel, cease not to cry unto the Lord our God for us, that he will save us.